Hello everyone, this is Mustafa Sadiq and today I will talk about the submission that I made with one of my friends uh, to the uh, competition or the worldwide competition from Schneider which is uh, Schneider Go Green uh, global student competition. Uh, this has been uh, done for uh, 10 years so today uh, this year was the 10th anniversary for this Go Green competition. It is like a competition of uh, the, different, uh, the challenge of uh, coming up with the uh, an idea for digital transformation, energy management, or automation uh, with uh, green uh, solutions uh, of, of using like green energy, uh, green things. And uh, I have been uh, uh, doing this for several years now, but uh, my submission for this year was a little uh, kind of special uh, because it is related to my uh, specialty or my research work, which is about 5G. So this is uh, the submission that I did for uh, the Go Green. Uh, competition and I will talk a little about it in this uh, short video. Uh, this uh, submission was done with the help or, or in coordination with the Tejas uh, Porwell uh, which is like an engineer, female engineer from India because uh, one of the conditions for this uh, competition is that uh, uh, the each each team should be at least two one or two and uh, one of them should be a female which is like one of the things to encourage uh, females to go for the engineering uh, 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 disciplines so the uh, project will be about uh, green 5g cellular uh, networks uh, first of all uh, the, the problem statement we know that uh, uh, 5g is now underway and uh, the deployment of 5g is happening worldwide uh, there are more than 70 countries around the world with the uh, uh, like uh, commercial 5g networks or at least a uh, trial uh, uh, networks and uh, they will come up live uh, so very soon uh, but uh, the problem is that uh, for with the 5g we need something called densification which uh, need means uh, like uh, the need for a lot of uh, uh, new small cells, uh, for example, for the US, the United States, we will need uh, more than 800,000 small space stations or small cells to uh, provide full coverage for the 5G for the nationwide, which means like uh, a huge uh, amount of construction, a huge amount of uh, capital that need to be spent to cover the entire nation. Uh, these small cells or small towers will require a huge amount of energy to operate them and they will emit a lot of uh, heat to the atmosphere. So uh, my idea was that why don't we use uh, like uh, uh, sol solar cells to operate these uh, small cells uh, using cellular energy uh, to power uh, these small cells uh, then we can uh, or actually solar energy this is just a typo uh, so we can uh, operate these uh, uh, small cells the idea is that uh, solar cells and uh, cellular uh, small cells can be uh, combined together in a cubic or diamond shaped uh, structures on the top of the buildings or the light posts or uh, 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 traffic lights or anywhere. Uh, these can be like hidden in, like, in the environment without uh, being noticed uh, because one of the problems with the 5G uh, towers is that uh, a lot of people uh, say that they will destroy the shape or the structure of the uh, urban cities or places where people uh, lived uh, together. So a lot of uh, companies already started coming up with uh, these creative ideas of making uh, their 5G uh, uh, cells to be like part of the environment and just being artistic work or uh, just uh, part of the decoration in the environment in the streets and the uh, buildings. Uh, the idea is that uh, we can make this diamond shaped uh, uh, design where we put the uh, uh, solar cells uh, on top of it and in these places where uh, they can face the sun from sunrise to sunset uh, from different sites and uh, uh, on the sides here you can put the like, uh, antenna uh, stations or the antenna elements even in this place here so they can face uh, all the users because we know that for the 5G we can make the 3D beam forming so they can uh, direct the transmission and reception to all these directions so the top part can be used for solar cells to uh, pr produce energy and uh, power to power these uh, other uh, parts of it. Uh, this is also like a 3D design. Uh, this is like a top view of it. This can be part of the light posts, as as we say, uh, as we see here, and these can be uh, like 
uh, fixed anywhere in, in the streets. Uh, this is like uh, one of the possible designs where the, we can make it like six faces or like six uh, sides, four sides, eight sides uh, diamond. And uh, these are like uh, different uh, dimensions for this uh, design. This is just like a, a, a suggestion and this can be improved. Uh, inside this uh, diamond uh, shaped uh, design, uh, th th uh, there can be a lot of uh, equipments like batteries to uh, uh, like for the energy to save the energy and uh, all the equipments for the antenna and RF uh, design. The expected benefits of this kind of design is that we can we will uh, reduce the need for uh, consume a lot of power from the national power grid uh, by using the cellular uh, or solar uh, uh, energy. Uh, national power grid also can be used as backup for emergencies. Uh, also, we can use these uh, public places like traffic lights, light posts, tops of the buildings or sides of the buildings to produce clean energy, which can be used for the 5G systems or for different other uh, things. Uh, with the coloring and decoration, these can be considered as artistic works and uh, they will reduce the uh, disturbance in the urban places. So they can be just like uh, uh, decoration for the places where they can be put. Uh, this was like the idea, main idea for our uh, suggestion. Uh, these are some references that we used for this uh, uh, suggestion or proposal. And uh, the slides for this, uh, this uh, proposal will be uh, under this video. Uh, finally, uh, special thanks for uh, Mr. Uh, Nawar Sirawi for the help in the design, the 3D design. These, these great, amazing designs uh, has been done by him because like he's uh, specialized in this play, in this thing. Uh, very uh, special thanks to him and uh, thank you very much so bye bye